Hello everyone. Thank you for joining me on this episode of JN Plays Badly. On today's episode, we're playing World of Warcraft, continuing our Let's Play on our Hunter. On our last episode, we made it all the way to the Red Ridge Mountains and the town of Lakeshire. While we were here, we dove into the water to find a lost necklace. And one of the other things we did while we were here, and that's why I'm kind of just looking around aimlessly now, we had a... Uh, I found a rare spawn that I think can be tamed. The only problem was I couldn't tame it at the time because I had um, what was the shield crafter? I had too many pets. So what I was hoping was that there was a stable master around somewhere. Oops, that's that. All the things. Now we're frozen for a second. Yeah, okay, thank you. Let's see if I can... No, that's a map pin. Oh, it looks like there's one right up ahead, actually. I don't know where. There's a quest up here. Cooking trainer, quest. Put people in the back, fruit seller. Hmm. Herbalism trainer. Anyway, the reason, it, anyway, the problem is, is that you can only have two active pets, so I need to be able to stable one of them, or I have to dismiss it completely in order to go and try to catch the other one. My, darn it, my big problem is my map is not, um, It shows it down here, but I don't actually see it. It actually says I should be looking right at them. Oh, haha. -ha. Well met. There we go. So now we just have Pooh Bear, because. I can have five pets in total, but I gotta learn pet five. Be careful. So now that that's out of the way, now that we know where that is, I'm just gonna summon a mount, and we're gonna try to go back over to where that rare spawn is real quick. And then there's some. Uh, then we can find a uh, a gnome decoder and kill some murlocs over here on the lake. But I want to go see if the uh, like I said, it was a rare spawn. And it was tameable, I believe. There's another one, but there was a dragon over here the other day, the last time I recorded a video, up on one of these rocks, but I'm pretty sure you can't tame him. So, slight detour to start off. There's another hunter, so hopefully. So there was copper. It lied to me. Uh, let me see. So, let's see. I remember coming from here. I remember that you could see it when you were flying to and from Red Ridge. I want to say... So, 
I think it spawned actually like right over here in this little in this little cove right here so it's not there right now I don't want to stick around and wait for it to come back I guess I can give it a couple of minutes and see if it comes back but it might be one of those things nope I guess it is not one of those things okay then going to dismiss you and we're going to see if we can um, does say tameable so there we go look at that we have uh, we have null fester feaster null feaster so he's a unique pet he keeps his unique model he's just a tarantula so obviously he shrinks you know when we actually catch him but now we have a unique uh, now we have a unique our basically our first truly unique pet so I'm gonna summon the larger warhorse then we're gonna go find we're gonna go keep doing some questing here. Like I said, just a short detour, nothing, you know, just because I wanted to see the, I wanted to see the, uh, whoops, stuck on a rock. Yeah, like I said, I just wanted to see, I just wanted to see if I could catch that pet quick before we do anything else. There's that hunter. The dragon back? No, he's not back. Murlocs like to yeah, around here. The Murlocs are actually in the water, so you gotta kind of you know you gotta fight in the water a little bit if you wanna. Kinda. Whoop. Hello. I gotta kill ten of these things, and I gotta get that gnome quarter back. I keep feel. I it keeps. I keep thinking that there's like guys coming after me because I hear this. I, don't have I hear uh, gnome feaster. In the background there. Yeah, no problem, bud. Yeah, you know, I, I used to do the same. I used to do the same thing. Yeah. It's a common. It's a fairly common practice, actually. I feel like. Sometimes, like, you're playing this game and... Oh, hey. <laughs> Old Gummers. I bet I can't... I know I can't tame him because he's an underwater creature, but... I also want... He's probably part of a quest later, but... I bet she can't. I, I don't know if I could actually... I don't know if I could actually beat him. He's a level 14 elite. Jeez, I can't even... Jeez, he's swim so fast I can't even catch up with him to see. Oh, there we go. Yeah, he cannot be tamed. He's an elite. We can try it. We got a pet. 
I can catch up with them. We might be able to. He's not that strong. He's not doing that much damage to us. Actually, he's not even fighting us. He's fighting our pet. I need a target. There you go. Not only did I get him, we hit level 15. And he gave us nothing. He must be an he must just be like one of those wandering elites then. All right, let's go find. I have unspent talent points. All right, uh, let's see. Your ranged special attack, critical strikes cause bleeding, fires a shot that poisons your target, and murder crows. I think I'll take Serpent Sting, actually, just because I like damage over time spells. It's locked. Damn. Okay. I apparently can breathe underwater? Really? Okay. Because I don't have either that or my... Yeah, either that or my thing disappeared, one or the other. I know I say it every video, the the gear that I have on, that heirloom gear that I have on, that's, you know, 90% of, uh, that's 90% of why uh, I'm leveling up so fast. Oh no, it just, for some reason it just didn't want to actually show, but that's alright, you have three minutes of uh, oxygen when you're underwater, so I wasn't actually worried about it. have a target. I am way... I am way too powerful stuff. Hey, a small barnacle, barnacled clam. Those are nice. I just realized that that shotgun blast does knock enemies back, but it doesn't actually do any damage. Interesting. something happened there. Alright. You need something? Need some of my junk. Safe travels. Alright, we'll head in here. You need something? Safe travels. This is already this is already giving me the hero's call for Duskwood.
be careful. I'm almost wondering if I should just go to, you know, go to Duskwood at this point. You know, Duskwood is a uh, 10 to 30 area. Of course, like I've said before, with level scaling and stuff like that, every area is, you know, level appropriate almost, unless you get into these zones that are like Twilight Highlands, uh, Vacher, they're both Tolbarad, you know, these are all cataclysm zones, so they're obvious they're so they're obviously unless you pick them as starting as unless you pick cataclysm as your starting area, you know, they're obviously gonna show as higher right now. It also could be that the feature doesn't actually show you right. Like I said, level scaling makes it that, oh, by the way, here's the hero's call for Red Ridge. It was supposed to give it, it should have been given at this particular level. It was uh, given at this level because... What can I do you know, for you? Alright, so this guy wants me to get some... Neither of these is going to be better because of what I'm wearing, but... That's alright. But I gotta, but I can recover the supply crates. Oh, They're probably north of me anyway. They are. Okay. And we'll go to the... If I hit 16 before the video ends, that's what I'm going to do. Though, if I hit 16 before it ends, I will... Um, So we got to kill Knowles and get their collars. They're north of us too, so it's probably a, it's probably a good thing because I can get the because they're the ones who probably stole the crates anyway. So, but anyway, as I was saying before that, now if I hit level 16, I'm going to go to the next area. There's not a whole lot of reason to stay in this area. Why is the ground shaking? Oh, because there's an Etten. Hello, Canyon Etten. I'm going to leave that alone for now. Do I have... I must have those. Okay. Who controls the ends? Who does control the ends? Hmm. Sure, why not? Oh, that reminds me, I never... <sighs> I never equipped my new belt, which is better for me. Nothing else that I have should actually be better for me right now, but... Nope, nope, I guess I was wrong. These shoes are better for me. They give me one more stamina. They kind of like that the enemies can't get to me, but... There's another human warrior. 
See, I don't think everybody leaves the area just because they see the hero's call, though, because she's actually toting at level 17 here. I think technically, if you think about it, probably all these quests go hand in hand. You know, I found that map or that letter, so I gotta come in here. But there's knolls along the way to it. There's probably knolls in the cave. Oh, okay. Apparently, we're doing this now. Hey, look, it's Yowler. He's a quest enemy for later. We'll uh, leave Yowler alone for now. If it comes to it. Where's the... Oh, it's way up here. Oh, the caves? Okay. We'll still leave Yowler alone. Looks like somebody else is going to fight him anyway, so. Actually, if somebody else is fighting him, you know what? I'll be nice. And there's the cave we want. Damn thing. All right. I'm gonna keep this up. Keep the more momentum going. Head into the cave and. Oh, Black Rock Orcs. I need a target. Okay. You know, to be honest, some of the music in this game is just amazing. You know, others, it's just like the ambient music, the ambient music. down here. There's a copper and a tin. Alright, see that? Level 16 already. So, probably I'll finish... I'll do what I said. I'll finish the quests that I'm working on, but I'm going to probably head um, out shortly after that. Kind of an us. Uh, Strange place for it to be. Sneak down here. Okay, sneaking fast. I don't have a target. Caves always confuse me though. They're sometimes hard to figure out how to get around. I 
actually have a lot of focus. I should just like unload with my focus abilities. I need a target. Since they also regenerate the focus, you know, it's like you only need the focus if you're using a lot of abilities. Alright. Maybe we'll be lucky this guy will also drop us the thing we need. He did not. That's alright. The orb hisses when you touch it. Oh, back so soon? gonna find our way out of here then I got because I still have to get one more red ridge knoll collar which means I need another red ridge knoll and I need I may have been missing an ability unless they were level scaled that looked like they had both of their pets out unless they had a combat and a non-combat pet I don't this will work. Oh, I can turn this in from here. Suppose that's not a terrible thing to do, so there we go. So we found this. It looks like the orcs. Under the direct command of Yowler. Okay. So, all right. Now the object. Now we can go defeat Yowler because now he's part of the quest. So we can make a big circle out of it. There were Ettens that way on the way back. So. There's a Yowler. I am Yowler, son of Yowler, brother of Yowler grandson of Yowler. Yes, we get it. Yowler is a very popular name among gnolls. He must have them. He does have them. Can I read them? I can read them. They are an orc. That actually makes sense. Okay. Oop. Always detour for ten.
there's actually tin. There's another tin vein right there. I gotta find an end, so I'll look around. But it looks like there's one right there. Oh, jeez. Yeah, yeah, come on. Alright, now we'll get this tin. And just like other times I've said it, I'm going to do... If I do any crafting or stuff, I'm going to do that off camera. But I think we've done... I think we've made some decent progress today, though, actually. Doesn't seem like it, you know, but, you know, that's... Think about an MMO. You don't win MMOs. You just get a little better every time. A lot of games like that. Oh, jeez. Wait, that better not be the cave. I'm going to be really upset because I walked all the way around. He's got that one. I'll let him have that one. They probably respawn fairly quickly anyway. So I'm going to be a 17 by the end of the video. I already know that. Especially if I keep... Especially if I keep fighting enemies. But I turn in these other quests and... You can bet that that's exactly what's going to happen. Oh, okay. Apparently we're doing this now. There isn't the end. That's too far. I was going to jump down to get back. As you can see it, it's right here. You know, Lake Shire is right there, but that's all right. Let's go fight some enemies now. The Etten. will take care of everything. I feel like so many people do the quest in so such a succession that you, know, you can't actually see the boulder they're talking about down here. It's like they're all gathered around, but the, the boulder's actually missing right now. Greetings. Turned in in the thing? Yes. Yep, they are. Okay. Light be with you. Light bless you. 
Okay, I'm talking about this guy named John Kinson. Can I get rid of this thing? I guess not. I guess I'm just stuck with this Ed and Karen. Follow with this Ed and follow me around. Okay, so this John Go with honor, Kishan is sitting around at the uh, inn. Oh, there you go. The what inn's can I do for you? See you later. I gotta go back to the inn anyway. I'll probably see what that entails. Maybe I'll stick around Red, Red Ridge. The enemies are supposed to scale to my level, so I don't have to go to Duskshire yet. Or Duskwood? Duskshire. I think the city, I think the town is Duskshire. I can do some back and forth quick. I think I trailed off earlier. Because I was doing other things. I was saying, though, that what I'm probably going to do, I'm probably going to do crafting and stuff off camera again. Uh, you know, I gathered a bunch of... Maybe not, a, maybe, well, okay, maybe not necessarily a bunch. But, you know... Somewhere. Oh, I was down here. But I got 30 more pieces, 36 more pieces of copper. I got five, four, t four silver. And somewhere. There it is. And so, and I gathered, and I have tin. So, you know, I have quite a bit of stuff. So I could play around with some crafting, but like I said, that's all off camera stuff. So. We'll go tell the colonel the bad news. Well met. For the alliance. All right. So weapons of war. Careful. The other one Need is help. in search of Bravo Company. Yeah, I don't know. Light I'll I'll figure it out. But as might not be bad. As I've said right along, as I've been saying right along, you know, all the areas in the game, you look on the map, all the areas in the game are registered as, you know, at the very least, either 10 through 30 or 15 through 30. You know, Duskwood is a 10 through 30, Stranglethorn Vale is 10 through 30, the Blasted Lands is, so everything goes to 30. Everything's supposed to go to 30. So if you want to keep doing an area, you can, you know other areas, like I said. You know, the Isle of Quildonis is a 25 to 30 zone. You get Twilight Highlands, which is a 30 to 35 zone. And that's mostly because these, like I said, these zones were added in other expansions. They're not part of the main... Um, you know, like, you know... With these Ice Crown and stuff, so... You know, the object is to get to level 30, because and then go from there because I can show you real quick on the map before we you know the Broken Isles they're 10 to 45 zones 
So you get to level 30, your your mis your mission essentially should be to go to you know is is to join the is to go into sh to that content because you know from there you know you're 30 you know you know the the whole thing is a little convoluted now because you've got all these zones that are just you know. Stormsong Valley is for some reason a 30 to 50, but Drusfar is 20 to 50, and the Tear Guard Sound is 10 to 50. You know? Then you got Mecha Mechagon Island over here, and Nazjatar over here, which are both level 50 zones. Now, I don't know if the map. Yes, it will. And then, of course, you go to the Shadow Zones, and they're. You know, the Shadow Zones are your 50, are basically your 51 uh, to 60 zones. So, you know, you've, you know, the whole, I think the whole leveling experience got a little convoluted, but it's not on it, it's not, um, it's not that it's not fun, let's put it that way, but, so, keep the video short and sweet, that way we don't get, that way nobody gets, um, so, That about does it for today's episode. If this is your first time here, hit those subscribe and notification buttons so you can stay up to date on everything I'm working on. You can also support the channel on Patreon, and there's a link to that in the description below. There is also a link to my Twitch channel so you can be notified when I'm streaming. As always, thank you for watching, and I'll see you next episode.